Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel, Latina Plants. My name is Jackie. Please make sure to click that bell to get notified every time I upload a video. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber already and give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Today we are doing a Lowe's shop with me and we're starting here with this display of air plants and calanchoes. They are from the Live Trends collection. And then here they have this beautiful basket of philodendron Brazil. Really cute pot. Down below they had this really cute pot of a raven, not raven ZZ, but regular ZZ variety. They also have this Dracinia, and this is from the Urban Jungles line. They also have some live trend pots. They have some peace lilies, some snake plants, Dracinias, and some ZZs up there. And then they have these down here that we've seen before. These really cute succulents. And I found this alocasia. I think this might be the alocasia mellow. If you know the variety of this alocasia, please leave it down below in the comments. I would really appreciate that. So they had some small ficus trees as well as some calatheas in these smaller pots. And I believe these are like $14.98, really affordable. And then they had a ton of Tradescanthia baskets. This one I think is the um baby bunny bellies. Really cute. That was the smaller pot for $16.98. And then the larger pot here of the purple Tradescanthia. And a smaller pot of this Peperomia. I don't remember what it's called. And they had this pot here of this Fetonia. And they had this pot of some, uh, I think, years. I'm not sure. This one's a spider plant. Really cute variegation. And then if you're looking for your regular heteracium, they have some small pots and some large pots available. And look at this beautiful pearls and jade. I believe it's a pearls and jade. And they had some more of these strawberry begonias and the succulents that they had before on the shelf. They have some wick and grow pots here. Of some parlor palms. Some ponytail palms. Some peace lilies in them, and they had a whole bunch of the global green pothos. And then up here they had some of the ivy hanging baskets, some more of the peperomia and teddy bear vines, or baby bunny belly, baby bunny belly. <laughs> Oh, that's a tongue twister, you guys. And on this side, they had a bunch of the hanging baskets of the golden pothos. These were going two for 24, I believe. I'm sorry if I'm going really fast, you guys. The store was jam packed with people's people. So they had your red anthuriums. In this setup here, they had a bunch of the bonsais. They're really cute gifts. And they had some Diffenbachias and some Bromeliads, along with some Dracinias. And I believe they even had the crocodile, I believe it's called the crocodile fern. And over here, they have some Calatheas, some Dracinias, some more ferns, and the Ficus Audrey, I believe, is called. And on this side, they had that pink Alocasia, some Aglionemas, 
these are the large plants that they had of ZZs. They also had this Peperomia, these very healthy Baltic Blues, and they had these for two for $30, which I thought was a great deal. They had some empty spots, so they'll probably be getting some more plants in soon, even though they had so much available already. And here's like an overview of all the hanging baskets and things they had. This golden pothos was so beautiful and variegated, and it was very, very heavy <laughs> for me to carry. So I tried to put it back as quick as possible without dropping it. And then they had this ficus. I believe it's a ficus variety. Some more of your heteraceum. They had the neon heteraceum. I don't know what this plant is, you guys. Is this a type of lipstick plant? I'm not sure. It's got like fuzzy stems, like fuzzy red stems. I thought it was pretty interesting. Try to scan the again. Some more ferns. And I was tempted in getting this lipstick plant here and she is the Mona Lisa so she has the red flower they also had a new shipment of African violets you guys they had so many different colors and some of the leaves were the darker leaves and some were some were the lighter green leaves I was tempted in getting a few of these, but I held off because I want to take care of the ones that I have now and learn about them before I go and add any more to my collection. And then in these cute little Wiccan grows, they had some of these begonias. They're really pretty. And they also had some of these Peperomia obtusifolia. This was just a green variety. They also had some Dracinias in there, some Diffenbachias, ferns. Here's another begonia variety. And they had some Marble Queen starters. More of the same Wick and Grow that they've had in the past. And I believe these are like $4.98 or maybe $5.98 now, the small Wick and Grow. Then they had these larger ones with the Aglionemas and the um, larger Wick and Grow pots. And here are some more Tratoscanthias, Strawberry Begonia. I'm trying to tell you guys the prices as I'm telling you the names. And I'm sorry if this is really fast because this store was jam-packed this day. It was really busy because we had gotten such a beautiful day of sunshine after so many days of rain. So people were out, plus it was the weekend. Look at this beautiful begonia, you guys. I haven't tried the begonia rex yet variety. I do like the cane begonias so far. But I love the coloring of the begonia rex as well. So here's some more of the Wick and Grow. I'm just trying to pan around and show you the different ones that they have available in case you're looking for any of them. And just outside, they had all of their new succulents and cacti. I thought this setup was beautiful. And I did slow this down because I did kind of go fast in this part. So I wanted to slow it down so you guys could get a look at what they actually had in stock. 
I went fast originally because, again, there were so many people out. And I didn't want to record anyone by accident. But I did also want to show you guys the setup. So, look at all of these beautiful, colorful succulents, you guys. They look so nice. And I can't believe that they have them outside already because, I don't know, I don't feel that it's that warm yet. But they seem to be doing well. They've been out here for a few days and none of them look like they have any cold damage. But look at all these different colors, different shapes. They're just beautiful, you guys. Beautiful succulents, all different varieties. Very affordable, cute little gift set pots. I really did enjoy looking at these, you guys. And they were very, very tempting. I wanted to, like, collect them all, you guys. Grab, like, one of each. <laughs> and then look at this peperomia here, you guys. If you know the name of this peperomia, please leave it down below in the comments. I never seen it before. I like the pattern on the leaves and the red backs. I thought it was really, really cute. I believe the basket was about $12.98. I don't know if it's a trailing or just an upright growth peperomia, but I thought that it was super cute. And so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber already and click on that bell to get notified every time I upload a video and I will check you guys out on my next video. Bye.